Well, here's the trolley wheel that we just recently restored for Grace Tully at the historical village in Kelowna, Iowa. And we wanted to do some short video clips to give you an idea of how this operates. It's a very cool wheel and we've enjoyed working on it. We still have a lot to learn about it. We've had some great help from Florence, the spinning wheel sleuth. And we think we've got this thing working the way that it should. To begin with, there's two bands, well actually three bands, on the wheel. The drive band, as you can see, goes around the, the main drive wheel. It comes through this pulley, this idler, which actually drops the band down in line with the head, and it gives it a little more wrap on the wheel. Then the band moves to the accelerator head, where it double wraps, if you can see that on around another idler pulley, and then on down to the frame of the wheel, back again to uh, the wheel itself. The other band is hooked to the front and the back of the carriage, and you can see the line moving forward to another idler pulley, down on around to a larger pulley where it needs to be wrapped four or five times then it comes on around if I can get this video to work to another idler and then back to the carriage and that's what moves the carriage back and forth then we've got the last man which hooks to the treadle although it doesn't operate as a normal treadle uh, that drives the wheel and to the other idler pulley that again drives the carriage back and forth. And that's what this treadle does, is it moves the carriage back and forth towards the spinner. The carriage itself runs on two quarter-inch steel rods that run the length of the wheel, as you can see. They act as rails. And then there's uh, wheels that ride on, uh, that, that are attached to the carriage, that ride on the uh, steel rails that will move move back and forth. The carriage itself uh, moves back and forth. I'm going to try to see if you can see it this way. Watch the treadle go up. Spin that large pulley, which again is attached to either side of the carriage, and then it goes back and forth that way. Hopefully this is clear to you. It's not as complicated as I may make it sound.